A timeline of events related to thermodynamics. Topic: Before 1800. 1650 Otto von Guericke builds the first vacuum pump. 1660 Robert Boyle experimentally discovers Boyle's law relating the pressure and volume of a gas. Published 1662. 1665 Robert Hooke stated heat being nothing else but a very brisk and vehement agitation of the parts of a body." 1669 J. J. Becker puts forward a theory of combustion involving combustible earth 1676–1689 Gottfried Leibniz develops the concept of vis viva, a limited version of the conservation of energy, 1679 – Denis Papin designed a steam digester which inspired the development of the piston and cylinder steam engine. 1694–1734 – Georg Ernst Stahl names Becker's combustible earth as phlogiston and develops the theory. 1698 – Thomas Savory patents an early steam engine. 1702 – Guillaume Montans introduces the concept of absolute zero, based on observations of gases. 1738 – Daniel Bernoulli publishes Hydrodynamica, initiating the kinetic theory 1749 – Émilie du Châtelet, in her French translation and commentary on Newton's Philosophiae Naturalis Principia Mathematica, derives the conservation of energy from the first principles of Newtonian mechanics. 1761 – Joseph Black discovers that ice absorbs heat without changing its temperature when melting. 1772 – Black student Daniel Rutherford discovers nitrogen, which he calls phlogisticated air, and together they explain the results in terms of the phlogiston theory. 1776 – John Smeaton publishes a paper on experiments related to power, work, momentum, and kinetic energy, supporting the conservation of energy. 1777 – Carl Wilhelm Scheele distinguishes heat transfer by thermal radiation from that by convection and conduction. 1783 – Antoine Lavoisier discovers oxygen and develops an explanation for combustion, in his paper, "'Reflections sur la phlogistique'". He deprecates the phlogiston theory and proposes a caloric theory. 1784 – Jan Ingenhuis describes Brownian motion of charcoal particles on water. 1791 – Pierre Prévost shows that all bodies radiate heat, no matter how hot or cold they are. 1798 – Count Rumford Benjamin Thompson performs measurements of the frictional heat generated in boring cannons and develops the idea that heat is a form of kinetic energy. His measurements are inconsistent with caloric theory, but are also sufficiently imprecise as to leave room for doubt. Topic: 1800 to 1847. 1802 – Joseph Louis Gay-Lussac publishes Charles's Law, discovered but unpublished by Jacques Charles around 1787, this shows the dependency between temperature and volume. Gay-Lussac also formulates the law relating temperature with pressure the pressure law, or Gay-Lussac's law. 1804 – Sir John Leslie observes that a matte black surface radiates heat more effectively than a polished surface, suggesting the importance of black body radiation. 1805 – William Hyde Wollaston defends the conservation of energy in On the Force of Percussion 1808 – John Dalton defends caloric theory in A New System of Chemistry and describes how it combines with matter, especially gases. He proposes that the heat capacity of gases varies inversely with atomic weight. 1810 – Sir John Leslie freezes water to ice artificially 1813 – Peter Ewart supports the idea of the conservation of energy in his paper on the measure of moving force, the paper strongly influences Dalton and his pupil, James Joule. 1819 – Pierre-Louis Dulong and Alexis Thérèse Petit give the Dulong petit law for the specific heat capacity of a crystal. 1820 – John Herapath develops some ideas in the kinetic theory of gases but mistakenly associates temperature with molecular momentum rather than kinetic energy, his work receives little attention other than from Joule. 1822 – Joseph Fourier formally introduces the use of dimensions for physical quantities in his Théorie analytique de la chaleur. 1822 – Mark Seguin writes to John Herschel supporting the conservation of energy and kinetic theory. 
1824 Sadi Carnot analyzes the efficiency of steam engines using caloric theory, he develops the notion of a reversible process and, in postulating that no such thing exists in nature, lays the foundation for the second law of thermodynamics, and initiating the science of thermodynamics. 1827 Robert Brown discovers the Brownian motion of pollen and dye particles in water. 1831 Macedonio Meloni demonstrates that black body radiation can be reflected, refracted, and polarized in the same way as light. 1834 Emile Clapeyron popularizes Carnot's work through a graphical and analytic formulation. He also combined Boyle's law, Charles's law, and Gay Lussac's law to produce a combined gas law, PV, T equals K. 1841 – Julius Robert von Mayer, an amateur scientist, writes a paper on the conservation of energy, but his lack of academic training leads to its rejection. 1842 – Mayer makes a connection between work, heat, and the human metabolism based on his observations of blood made while a ship's surgeon, he calculates the mechanical equivalent of heat. 1842 – William Robert Grove demonstrates the thermal dissociation of molecules into their constituent atoms, by showing that steam can be disassociated into oxygen and hydrogen, and the process reversed. 1843 – John James Waterston fully expounds the kinetic theory of gases, but is ridiculed and ignored. 1843 – James Joule experimentally finds the mechanical equivalent of heat. 1845 – Henri Victor Regnault added Avogadro's law to the combined gas law to produce the ideal gas law. PV equals NRT 1846 – Carl Hermann Knobloch publishes De colore radiante disquisitions experimentis quibus dam novus illustrate 1846 – Grove publishes an account of the general theory of the conservation of energy and on the correlation of physical forces. 1847 – Hermann von Helmholtz publishes a definitive statement of the conservation of energy, the first law of thermodynamics. Topic 1848 to 1899. 1848 – William Thomson extends the concept of absolute zero from gases to all substances. 1849 – William John McCorn Rankin calculates the correct relationship between saturated vapor pressure and temperature using his hypothesis of molecular vortices 1850 – Rankin uses his vortex theory to establish accurate relationships between the temperature, pressure, and density of gases, and expressions for the latent heat of evaporation of a liquid. He accurately predicts the surprising fact that the apparent specific heat of saturated steam will be negative. 1850 – Rudolf Clausius gives the first clear joint statement of the first and second law of thermodynamics, abandoning the caloric theory, but preserving Carnot's principle 1851 – Thomson gives an alternative statement of the second law 1852 – Joule and Thomson demonstrate that a rapidly expanding gas cools, later named the Joule-Thomson effect or Joule-Kelvin effect 1854 – Helmholtz puts forward the idea of the heat death of the universe 1854 – Clausius establishes the importance of dq, t, Clausius's theorem, but does not yet name the quantity 1854 – Rankin introduces his thermodynamic function, later identified as entropy 1856 – August Kronig publishes an account of the kinetic theory of gases, probably after reading Waterston's work 1857 – Clausius gives a modern and compelling account of the kinetic theory of gases in his On the Nature of Motion called Heat 1859 – James Clerk Maxwell discovers the distribution law of molecular velocities 1859 – Gustav Kirchhoff shows that energy emission from a black body is a function of only temperature and frequency 1862 – Disgregation – a precursor of entropy, was defined in 1862 by Clausius as the magnitude of the degree of separation of molecules of a body 1865 – Clausius introduces the modern macroscopic concept of entropy 1865 – Joseph Loschmidt applies Maxwell's theory to estimate the number density of molecules in gases, given observed gas viscosities. 1867 – Maxwell asks whether Maxwell's demon could reverse irreversible processes 1870 – Clausius proves the scalar virial theorem 1872 – Ludwig Boltzmann states the Boltzmann equation for the temporal development of distribution functions in phase space, and publishes his H-theorem 
1873 Johannes de Durek van der Waals formulates his equation of state 1874 Thomson formally states the second law of thermodynamics 1876 Josiah Willard Gibbs publishes the first of two papers the second appears in 1878 which discuss phase equilibria, statistical ensembles, the free energy as the driving force behind chemical reactions, and chemical thermodynamics in general. 1876 Loschmidt criticizes Boltzmann's H theorem as being incompatible with microscopic reversibility. 1877 Boltzmann states the relationship between entropy and probability. 1879 Joseph Stefan observes that the total radiant flux from a blackbody is proportional to the fourth power of its temperature and states the Stefan Boltzmann law. 1884 Boltzmann derives the Stefan Boltzmann blackbody radiant flux law from thermodynamic considerations. 1888 Henri Louis Le Chatelier states his principle that the response of a chemical system perturbed from equilibrium will be to counteract the perturbation. 1889 Walther Nernst relates the voltage of electrochemical cells to their chemical thermodynamics via the Nernst equation. 1889 Svante Arrhenius introduces the idea of activation energy for chemical reactions, giving the Arrhenius equation. 1893 Wilhelm Wien discovers the displacement law for a blackbody's maximum specific intensity. Topic 1900 to 1944. 1900 Max Planck suggests that light may be emitted in discrete frequencies, giving his law of black body radiation. 1905 Albert Einstein argues that the reality of quanta would explain the photoelectric effect. 1905 Einstein mathematically analyzes Brownian motion as a result of random molecular motion. 1906 Nernst presents a formulation of the third law of thermodynamics. 1907 – Einstein uses quantum theory to estimate the heat capacity of an Einstein solid 1909 – Constantine Carathéodory develops an axiomatic system of thermodynamics 1910 – Einstein and Marian Smolahovsky find the Einstein–Smolahovsky formula for the attenuation coefficient due to density fluctuations in a gas 1911 – Paul Ehrenfest and Tatiana Ehrenfest Afanasieva publish their classical review on the statistical mechanics of Boltzmann der Statistischen Auffassung in der Mechanik 1912 – Peter Debye gives an improved heat capacity estimate by allowing low-frequency phonons 1916 – Sidney Chapman and David Enskog systematically develop the kinetic theory of gases 1916 – Einstein considers the thermodynamics of atomic spectral lines and predicts stimulated emission 1919 – James Jeans discovers that the dynamical constants of motion determine the distribution function for a system of particles 1920 – Mag Nad Saha states his ionization equation 1923 – Debye and Eric Huckel publish a statistical treatment of the dissociation of electrolytes 1924 Satendra Nath Bose introduces Bose Einstein statistics, in a paper translated by Einstein. 1926 Enrico Fermi and Paul Dirac introduce Fermi Dirac statistics for fermions. 1927 John von Neumann introduces the density matrix representation and establishes quantum statistical mechanics. 1928 John B. Johnson discovers Johnson noise in a resistor. 1928 Harry Nyquist derives the fluctuation dissipation theorem, a relationship to explain Johnson noise in a resistor. 1929 Lars Onsager derives the Onsager reciprocal relations. 1938 Anatoly Vlasov proposes the Vlasov equation for a correct dynamical description of ensembles of particles with collective long range interaction. 1939 Nikolai Krylov and Nikolai Bogolubov give the first consistent microscopic derivation of the Fokker Planck equation in the single scheme of classical and quantum mechanics. 1942 Joseph L. Dub states his theorem on Gauss Markov processes. 1944 Lars Onsager gives an analytic solution to the two dimensional icing model, including its phase transition. Nineteen forty five present. 
1945–1946 Nikolai Bogolyubov develops a general method for a microscopic derivation of kinetic equations for classical statistical systems using BBGKY hierarchy. 1947 – Nikolai Bogolyubov and Kirill Gurov extend this method for a microscopic derivation of kinetic equations for quantum statistical systems 1948 – Claude Elwood Shannon establishes information theory 1957 – Alexander Solomonovich Kompanitz derives his Compton scattering Fokker–Planck equation 1957 – Ryogo Kubo derives the first of the Green–Kubo relations for linear transport coefficients 1957 – Edwin T. Jaynes gives Max an interpretation of thermodynamics from information theory. 1960–1965 – Dmitry Zubarov develops the method of non-equilibrium statistical operator, which becomes a classical tool in the statistical theory of non-equilibrium processes. 1972 – Jacob Bekenstein suggests that black holes have an entropy proportional to their surface area. 1974 – Stephen Hawking predicts that black holes will radiate particles with a black body spectrum which can cause black hole evaporation 1977 – Ilya Prigogine wins the Nobel Prize for his work on dissipative structures in thermodynamic systems far from equilibrium. The importation and dissipation of energy could reverse the second law of thermodynamics. See also History of physics History of thermodynamics Timeline of information theory List of notable textbooks in statistical mechanics <laughs>